Hey everyone listening, hey brothers and sisters in Christ, God is good all the time. All the time God is good. Here is a man that calls himself the catalyst. He's like a self-help kind of guy. Transforming lives by transforming minds. Hmm. Here he is, Lanre Olusula, the catalyst. Ask the catalyst, right? He's here to help people. He's doing the Anjali Mudra prayer hands. Who's he praying to? See, the pastor's locker room. He's here to help pastors. I, I'm always turned off of men and women that are teaching people about sex, right? That's between you and your partner to grow in that way. I lived with my girlfriend for years before, many years ago. I've, I've told my testimony. In 2015, God pulled me out of that relationship. I didn't understand what was going on in life. That's when Jesus Christ came into my life. I did get into the new age for a bit because I thought I was raising my vibration and consciousness and I was connecting with God. But the new age is a bunch of satanic garbage. Anyway, so helpless sex, no thank you. If this person is a Christian, why is he posting some of meditating and the whole, like, you know, you're a creator, believe you're successful, I am successful, right? Sounds a little new age. He posts this on his social media. The girl is doing 666 over her eye. Here he is with some of his friends. The guy on the second to the left is doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra, the gesture of Satan's fake enlightenment, deception from Satan, pride of humanity. And our friend the Catalyst is doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra as well. Of course he is. This is the world we live in. You know, people can be helpful, but we must use discernment in all things. Like, I'm sure they're successful regular people that are Christians. But again, Christians aren't really regular people in this world. We stand out a lot. People don't like us because they prefer their own bubble of a world. They prefer to live in sin and lies. The truth hits you hard. You have to change your life. You have to repent. If you know the truth about Jesus Christ, the biblical world, and about Satan and his ways, you will want to run to Jesus Christ and you won't be so trusting of people. It's hard to do that at first. I want to trust people. I trust you, brothers and sisters, but you know what I mean. We must use discernment and discretion in all things. God bless you, everyone.